Hello everybody, my name is Nathan Sifu, and welcome to Mass Effect 3. Let's play. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Looks good so far. Copy that. Cortez? Cortez! Oh, I would not like that. I would not like losing contact in a place like that. <laughs> Not sure if you can read me out there. Looks like I finished the major descent. Can't see much from here. Suit is holding up. Emergency systems have come online. Life support operation. This is a. Uh... This is quite a thing. I, I thought this was uh, a really cool way to do this. Setting down all non-critical systems to preserve remaining power. Not sure how much juice the emergency thruster will need to get me back to the surface. Can't worry about that now. I'd be a little bit worried about it now. Getting some strange readings from the probe. Something is definitely down there. Wonder if we'll find Rapture down here. I mean, interesting little crossover. Reading the probe directly below me. Looks like the final drop. Ooh, here I go. Can't see anything just yet. Oh, this is uncomfortable. I can't look all the way down. <laughs> Found the probe. Seems intact. I'm gonna keep moving. Find Leviathan. <clears throat> Wait, where am I headed to? Oh, I think I'm doing it right. What is that? Oh boy. Here it comes. Yo. We found it. Your mind belongs to me. 
Oh shit. Yen. <coughs> What's happening? Your memories give voice to our words. Your nature will be revealed to us. Accept this. I don't understand. The galaxy's at war with the Reapers. You defeated one. Why aren't you fighting back? There's no war. There's only the harvest. Then help us stop it. None have possessed the strength in past cycles. Your own species could be destroyed with a single thought. But you are different. I have witnessed your actions in this cycle. The destruction of Sovereign. The fall of the Collectors. The Reapers perceive you as a threat. And I must understand why. Oh no. shit ah uh, the first harvest yeah let's talk about that how did the intelligence defeat you to find a solution it required information physical data drawn from organic life in the cosmos it created an army of pawns that searched the galaxy gathering this data there was no warning no reason given when they turned against us Tell me about this intelligence. You built that machine despite what you saw the other races experience. Why? You cannot conceive of a galaxy that bends to your will. Every creature, every nation, every planet we discovered became our tools. We were above the concerns of lesser species. The intelligence was envisioned as simply another tool. And now we all pay the price for your mistake. There was no mistake. It still serves its purpose. Your survival. Let's talk about that. How did you remain hidden all this time? Our extermination was not complete. Some survived and found refuge in the dark corners of the galaxy. I am their progeny. Over the cycles, the thrall races were controlled. Removing traces of our existence as we directed them to. In this way, our survival was kept secret from the Reapers. Today, we reach out through the fragments and watch for discovery. Fragments? You mean the artifacts we found? They provide a window into the galaxy. Tools for exploring the events of this cycle for the safety of this world. Through them, Um, the Reapers. Tell me about the Reapers. Each harvest ends with the birth of a Reaper, perfect in its design, each formed in Harbinger's image, our image. Each Reaper has the power to influence organics. Over countless cycles, this ability was refined, perfected, and gave rise to indoctrination. Um, why cycles? What's the point of all these harvests? The intelligence is one purpose. Preservation. 
creation of life. That purpose is not being fulfilled. It directed the Reapers to create the Mastery Haze to speed the time between cycles to greatest efficiency. The galaxy itself became an experiment. Evolution its tool. Will it ever end? Unknown. Until the intelligence finds what it's looking for, the harvest will continue. And then, ah, uh, the Crucible. What do you know about the Crucible? We have watched its construction before. It has never been completed. Those who have tried still fell victim to the harvest. Its outcome is unknown. Okay, you made your point. Will you help stop the cycle? I have searched your mind. You are an anomaly. That is not enough. Wait! The cycle will continue. No. You've been watching. You know this cycle is different. We will survive. You will remain here as a servant of our needs. The Reapers will harvest the rest. If you release me, no one has to be harvested. Nothing will change. And, um, he already has. The Reapers know where you are. You can't just watch anymore. You have to fight. Even if you survive the battle today, the Reapers won't stop. Ever. Release me and we have a chance to end this, once and for all. That's bad. That's not good. Oh, there's two more there. Jeez, you got a you got a council of leviathans. Your confidence is singular. I've earned it. Out there fighting, where you should be. It is clear why the Reapers perceive you as a threat. Your victories are more than a product of chance. We will fight, but not for you or any lesser race. We will first the Apex race. We will survive. And the Reapers who trespass on this world will understand our power. They will become our slaves. Today, they pay their tribute in blood. <laughs> Get up. Well, I'm glad I had that. I'm glad I had that booster on the back. <laughs> oh, we made it. We got to talk to a Leviathan and rally them to our cause. Good, dude. Nice. Damn it, we got a Reaper inbound. 
Yeah, not for long, we don't. <laughs> Fuck you, buddy. Got you back. What happened down there? We found it. It's real. And a lot more than we ever imagined. So was it worth almost dying for? Yes. It was. We exposed it. Pushed it into the light. Whether it likes it or not, it's a part of this war now. And it's gonna help fight. It sounds like an impressive accomplishment. Yeah. One for the history books. Oh, if, the, if there's going to be even any books left after this war. Oh. Oh, I'm glad I was able to get that mission finished tonight. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to be ending off the stream right after things get wrapped up here. The Alliance wanted more intelligence on the Reapers. I'd say we got it. Our people will be studying it for years to come. They're already calling it the Leviathan Codex. It rewrites galactic history as we know it. Whatever else it means, it tells me the Reapers had a beginning. And maybe now we'll provide them with an end. That's one way to look at it. I guess it's the only way. So go out there and make it happen. This is a big step in the right direction, Shepard. Good work. Thank you, sir. Hack it out. Wicked. I did it. Okay. So, oh yeah, actually, uh, that's right. We now have them as a, as a war asset. I think I should. Alien, uh, liquid assets? Oh. Levi Leviathan Enthrallment. Okay, I'm actually going to read this just before I end things off. A mixed species team of special operations soldiers have volunteered to covertly uh, deliver uh, Levi Leviathan artifacts behind enemy lines. Uh, these attacks aim to make Reaper uh, creatures, th uh, creatures thralls for, of the Leviathans. On a small scale, this could cause chaos and disruption. On a large scale, and if given enough time, it could form an army of reaper culture, uh, uh, reaper creatures uh, dedicated to the uh, to exterminating their own kind. The team's major t uh, major limiting factors are the small number of artifacts and the reluctance of the alliance commanders to operate openly with such a potent weapon, for fear the reapers might uh, develop a countermeasure. Yeah, that's fair enough. But I mean, that four hundred—that's a pretty big war asset that's like what's actually oh that is the biggest war asset asset holy shit wow but um actually yeah let me let me get a good look at that thing again man that is some cool all right so that um so that is uh it for this session and um yeah i have I have no idea what I want to take aim at next for uh, um, for finishing up the game uh, or what, what side quests I want to do or whatever. But I think whenever it is that I get to the, uh, the Citadel DLC, I think that will probably be spread across two streams because it is so gigantic that I think I'm going to need two streams just to get through all of the content. But uh, yeah, this, uh, this was a good session. I'm, I'm, Mm, I'm pumped that I got this finished tonight. On to the next one.
That was fun, but I'll have to pause it there. If you enjoy my content and want to see more, do some of the stuff that the screen is telling you, and check out my other stuff. If you want to see me play live, check out the links in the description. Come talk to me, maybe even play with me. That is it for this episode, and I will see you in the next game.